Well, hello everyone and welcome again. We're so glad to be connecting with you and to have this time together. Today's a special daily devo because I have the honor of having my beautiful bride with me. But, you know, I know that this whole pandemic thing, you know, it's it's still going on. Uh, it seems like some things are opening up, but we're still walking through it. And I know that some of you are frustrated, some of you are afraid, and that's why we're here, is we want to walk with you during this time. We want to help walk with you, give you something to latch onto, some words of hope, some encouragement, something to help you grow. And so we're going to share... Um, I actually invited Marie to share. Um, so go ahead and, and share what's on your heart. Sure. So as I was reading this morning, um, a passage I'm very familiar with, I'm reading through the book of John, and I got to John chapter 3, where uh, Jesus has this famous conversation with uh, Nicodemus, one of the religious leaders of that time. And uh, I got past John 3.16, right, which sums up pretty much the Gospel of John, for God so loved the world. That he gave his only son that whoever believes in him should not perish but have eternal life and then past that you get to john 3 17 which i paused on today and really started reflecting on and it reads like this god sent his son into the world not to judge the world but to save the world through him and it made me think about what a beautiful God we serve uh, made me think about Jesus as my friend right and one of the um, things is in, in friendships right you, you there's trust when you don't feel judged and you know it says here that God did not Jesus did not come to judge me mm. he came to save me so it means that Jesus looks past my messes mm. my failures uh, my wrongdoings he looks past that at what could be the Marie that could be the Marie mm. that he created me to be and he created you to be and I focused on that and I just was just delighting in that beautiful friend that I have in Jesus right there's that old song what a friend we have in Jesus and I thought God you're such a good friend you look past my mess and you look at what could be and I just I, I felt so blessed mm. um, so um, just filled just reading that today just so encouraged um, and another thing though is you know he, 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 he doesn't judge us but he does confront our sin because John, ch John talks about Jesus being lo the light right yeah. and so so it's not like he's ignoring our sin the light his light shines on us shines on the darkness and we know light and darkness cannot mix and he confronts us with our sin but he confronts us lovingly because he knows what we could be he knows what we could be um in in the person he created us to be right so he confronts us lovingly um not judgmentally and that's i think that's um what a beautiful, perfect example of a friend. Mm, that's so good. That's what I have. I love it. I love it. So the verse is, is John 3.17. Mm -hmm. the, the thought is the friendship that God offers us. And, and so may we be a people who accept the friendship of Jesus that looks beyond what we are to what, could, what we could be. And mm. um, I think that's awesome. Give us eyes to see God. Yes. other people what they could be not what they are right now but what they could be like you look at us mm -hmm. we love you and remember be, be a, a miracle, miracle.